probably more bones are at the bottom of the sea somewhere in the Southern Ocean than have ever been collected from New Zealand. Thomas Hood Cockburn Hood came to North Canterbury in the late 1850s. Up in the Wiper Gorge, he found the bones of these giant marine reptiles. He sent a small package to Richard Owen, who was the founder of the British Museum of Natural History. Cockburn Hood's second, much larger collection was sent back in um, 1869 aboard the ship Matoka, and it had two large crates of bones aboard, um, and these were lost with the ship. We don't know where the ship was lost, it was never sighted at sea, although there were, it really was a, a bit of a mystery even back then, that there were several false records of its um, sighting, and there were also um, even a record in the New Zealand newspapers saying that it successfully reached um, Southampton, something that it never did. So we don't know where those two large crates are, somewhere in the Southern Ocean probably. It's very likely he probably hit an iceberg in the middle of the night and the ship was lost with all hands and crew.